In this tutorial I will be using an Xbox 360 wireless gaming receiver for Windows, two Xbox 360 wireless controllers, two monitors with the same resolution and aspect ratio, and a PC powered by an AMD graphics card. In order for Portal 2 to operate at 32x9 you must go to the Portal 2 folder in your Steam apps and locate the split screen config config file. You can do this very easily by searching for split screen in the root of the Portal 2 directory. Once you have found the folder and opened it in your preferred text editor, you need to change the line closest to the bottom that reads 8x9 to 16x9. Simply replace the 8, do not replace anything else. In order for Portal 2 to be able to recognize a dual display setup, you will need to go into the AMD Catalyst Control Center and create a new iFinity display group. Once in the sub-menu, select the main monitor you wish to use, continue, select the display layout, for our purposes we're going to be using 2x1, and then select the other display you wish to use. You may need to arrange the, the desktops as they will, but they may be the wrong way around. And then you're done. Now all we need to do is load up Portal 2. Then, once in Portal 2, you will need to go into the Options menu and then Video menu and change the resolution to whatever native is. For me, it's 3840 by 1080 because that's twice 1920 by 1080. In order to begin playing, select Cooperative Play with the Player 1 controller and then press X on the second or Player 2 controller. And there you have it, you are now playing Portal 2 across two displays at twice 1080p and preferably 60fps.